welcome friends in this video we are going to learn how to calculate approximate values of square roots by using square root tables this means in this video we are going to use square root tables to find the square root of the given numbers and we shall learn this method by an example and the example says find the square root of the following numbers by using a square root table and we are given four parts of this examples and we shall start with part one in part one we are given a number 20 given number is 20 and we have to find the square root of 20 by using square root table so first of all we shall write this 20 inside the radical and now we shall factorize this 20 and we can factorize 20 like this 2 into 2 into 5 and we see that there is a pair of prime factors and that is pair of 2 and now we shall factorize this 20 and we can factorize this 20 like this 2 into 2 into 5 and now we shall group these two factors and take 1 out of this radical then it will be 2 root 5 and by using the square root table we know that the value of root 5 is 2.236 2.236 and now we shall multiply 2 with this 2.236 we get it will be 4.472 so this is the value of root 20 and now we shall move to the second part and the second part we have to find the square root of 5 over 12 so we shall write this value like this and we can write this value like this root 5 over root 12 and we can factorize this 12 by uh, like this 2 into 2 into 3 and here is root 5 and this value can be written as 2 root 3 so finally the value is root 5 over 2 root 3 and now we shall use the square root table and in square root table the value of root 5 is 2.236 and value of root 3 is 1.732 and now we should calculate this value this is if we cancel out this 2 with this 2.236 we get 1.118 so it is 1.118 over 1.732 and if we divide this uh, 1.118 by this 1.732 we get 0 0.645 so this is the square root of 5 over 12 and now we shall move to the third part of the example and in third part we are given a number 0 0.00064 and we have to find the square root of this value so we shall write it like this and first of all we shall remove this decimal point by putting multiples of things in denominator so we can write it like this 0 0.0064 over 1 and now we shall put as many zeros in the right side of this one as 
the number of digits in decimal part of this number and we see and there are five digits in the decimal part of this number so we shall write five zeros here and remove this decimal point finally this number is 64 over 1 lakh and we can factorize this 64 like this 8 into 8 and this 1 lakh like this 100 into 100 into 10 so we can take out 8 from this pair and 100 from this pair from uh, from this radical so we can write this 8 over 100 into 1 over root 10 now we shall use the square root table to put the value of root 10 and the value of root 10 is 3.162 and now we can calculate this value it will be 8 over 316.2 and we can remove this decimal point by just putting a zero here finally this number will be 80 over 3162 and if we divide this 80 by this 3162 we get 0 0.0253 so this is the value of a square root of 0 0.00064 and now we shall move to the last part of the example and in last part we are given a number and in last part we are given a number 432 and we have to calculate the square root of this number so we shall write this number under the sign of radical and now we shall factorize this number And if we factorize this 432, we get 2 into 2 into 2 into 2. Any four this means 4 times. And 3 into 3 into 3, this means 3 times. Now we can pair, make pair of these factors like this. And take one factor of each bracket. We get 2 into 2 into 3 into root 3 then it will be 12 root 3 so now we shall use square root table and in a square root table the value of root 3 is 1.732 and if we multiply 12 uh, with this 1.732 we get 20.784 so this is the solution of the fourth part Thank you.